Hold on, give me one second. Check my text. Peace, peace. Um, <laughs> yeah, I got the itis, man. I got the itis. I just finished uh, eating a little while ago. Got the itis. Uh, I was on the phone with my bro, man. Um, Hassan Higgins. Uh, go. Um, Google the name, Hassan Higgins. Uh, been knowing the brother. Uh, what I'm forty five. Oh man. I've been knowing this brother f forever, really, forever, man. Shout out to Hassan Higgins, man, doing a beautiful job uh, with his grandson. We we just got off the phone. We was conversing, and I was I was telling him uh, when I see Mayweather, you know, Mayweather uh, boxing with his little grandson and teaching him certain things. Um, I think of my man Hassan Higgins, just on a different level uh, with the books and the information. And everything like that, man. So shout out to you, bro. Shout out to you, bro. It's kind of rainy. Uh, so I told him, I'm going to stay in today and just chill. Um, we we on 42nd with my daughter tomorrow. So I'm just going to chill today, man. But shout out to him and his grandson, man. And that's, that's what it's about, man. It's about raising that generation, that next generation, and, and actually giving them something that many of us didn't have, man. Many of us didn't have, man. So, um... I definitely, um, I definitely big that up, man. Anybody that's doing it, man. Anybody that's doing it, um, you know, giving these children uh, the confidence, right? Um, giving them the confidence and um, and letting them know that they can do what really whatever they want to do, man. It doesn't matter where you come from, where you born um, at, right? It's just it's the spirit that you got inside of you, and we as parents, as caregivers. It's our responsibility, man, to install that into the young shorties, man. What, what? I mean, come on, man. What, what else can we do for them but to install that confidence and and teach them, man? You know, teach them with love. You know, teach them with love, man. Teach them a trade. Um, so when I see the brother boxing you, boxing you, um, out there with the little, with the little shorties, man, teaching them how to box and all that, man. I really um. I really uh, consider that, man, and I really love that when I see that, man. So, um, and these are brothers, um, you know, individuals like individuals who, who taught me, man. Um, you know, my, my pops, man, um, he installed that into me young, man. So books, it's like, oh, man, I, I really love them, man. I'm, I'm a book addict for information. I ain't going to front. Everybody knows that about me. Uh, Love books, man. Thousands of books, you know, boxes of books. Uh, just love books, man. It takes me um, somewhere else, man. It takes me somewhere else. I remember um, um, Malcolm X. Rest in peace to the brother Malcolm X. Um, he said that reading books, information is the black man's passport. Meaning that you travel mentally, you know, you travel um, you know, when you read, man, when you educate yourself, this is how you can, this is why you can talk to some people. They may not have been to a place physically, but they can tell you more about that place than the person that has actually been there physically. So salute to all my book readers, salute to all my book readers. Um, maybe Nick, uh, you guys ever heard of, um, book phone challenge? I'm not sure if you guys ever heard of it, but um, go check that out. And um, I'll tell you the, the back story um, that some other day, man. Uh, but salute to um, to to my book readers, man. Um, yeah, I was, I was looking at uh, some other YouTubers in, in this section, and it seems like everybody wants to be the top dog, man. Or a lot of people want to be the top dog. And they're willing to embarrass themselves or embarrass others for that spot, man. I said, wow, this is crazy that we will throw each other under the bus. We will uh, try to demolish each other. I mean, just for that spot, man. Um, you know, so many people uh, want the fame. Uh, I think it was uh, Open Minded. Brother Open Minded. Salute to Brother Open Minded. Go subscribe to his page, man, he has that good information, and I didn't even know that, I didn't even know, I'm glad we did that live, uh, me and the brother Quasi, 
and um, I was, you know, able to find out, man. So I'm gonna definitely support the brother on those DVDs. Um, so open minded, if you're listening to this or if you get a chance to check this out, put your um, your link in the comments section so everybody can know. Let them know you got the DVDs. Hoodie season coming up. The brother got the hoodies uh, in the garments. So go check the brother out. But me myself, I would never call a dude an uh, individual, my brother, a sister, and then if we, we happen to fall out or we bump heads, whatever, you will never hear me come online and uh, diss them or try to embarrass them or say this about them. Never, ever. Never, ever. And, th and that's one of the things that a lot of people, uh, you know, they just don't understand. They just don't understand. But if I call somebody my brother, that's for a reason. And if, and if we happen to fall out... That doesn't take from that the person is still a wonderful person. They 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 still have talent. They still um they they shine their light. I mean, it's just sometimes things don't work out or you bump heads or we don't. It's just timing. Sometimes it's with timing. So I, I see that. I'm I'm watching some joints while I'm eating. I'm, I'm catching um a few joints and I'm like, wow, man, this is in two. It doesn't really seem like the person believes what they're saying. I had said that um, a while before. A lot of these people, that's just like when a person um, shouts you out, amps, amps your name up and all of that. Sometimes they're just doing it just to do it, man. Just to do it, just because it sounds cool. And um, they feel like, hey, maybe it might bring them uh, some traffic, some clientele to their page, man. It's, it's sick. This is why it's best to do things from the heart. Or if you, or if, you, if, you if you don't want to do it, you just don't do it. You know what I mean? I, I mean myself, I never beg people or ask people uh, to shout me out, support me, share my videos. I'd rather you do it because you want to do it from the heart. There's no pressure. I'm still going to support you. I'm still going to show you love. It doesn't matter because that's really, um, that's not what it's all about. I want people to be themselves. Um, I got people that I speak to on the daily. And um, they, they watch my videos, but sometimes they might not comment. Um, they might not press like, whatever the case may be. But it's nothing to hold them, um, to nail them to a cross for, man. N nothing to take personal. Some people are just, um, they just like to stroll. They just like to watch videos without really getting involved. Uh, it, it just is what it is, man. We take a lot of things too serious and it's destroying our community. If you're going to help somebody, you help them and you keep it moving. The other day, uh, I think it was, she thinks she was Indian, an Indian lady coming out of the store and I held the door for her and, um, you know, I just kept walking. I just kept it moving and some, some, someone's like pointing. And, um, you know, the guy was saying, hey, somebody's saying something to you. So the lady was saying, thank you. But I didn't even really wait for the thank you. I just opened the door because it was the right thing to do and just kept it moving. But it, it was good to hear her say thank you. And I said, you're welcome, ma'am. And, and kept it moving. Proceeded to train and got on the train and everything like that. But you got some of us, if, you, if they share your video... And you don't share their video or if they don't see you in their live or they chat, they say you acting funny when that's not really true. Some people are busy. Some people got businesses. Some people have things to do. Let, I mean, well, I can't tell people what to do, but I, I choose not to take it too serious. My brothers is my brothers. My sisters is my sisters. Um, I have family members, family members that um, when I see them, uh, they support me. They support my business, but I don't see them online on my channel, up and down, YouTube. And but when I see them, they support me. They donate to the cause. So you know, I mean, we we're not gonna really get nowhere with that. I understand uh, with the internet, and now you can just hold a camera in front of your face, and and you know, everybody wants to be something they're not. I mean, people are chasing clout. Which this is not really clout. Clout is when you're able to make political moves, when you're able to move things around. You you own land, um, you know. You taking care of people. Clout is not it's not a negative word, but it's the people that have made it negative because they didn't really have an understanding of the word. 